least 200 gunmen were killed in the past three days in Nigeria's central northern state of Niger during a security operation. The state commissioner in charge of internal security, Emmanuel Umar, said some leaders of armed gangs were among those killed. Dozens of motorbikes used by the armed gangs to raid villages, weapons and cattle were also recovered. The operation to clear armed gangs from the area was a coordinated effort by the army, volunteers from local vigilante groups and community leaders. Gunmen have terrorized citizens in the north and northwest of the country. Last month, President Muhammadu Buhari said the military had begun a major offensive against militants in the state of Niger. Sijitian's Ajak Mangut is in Abuja and joins us live from there for more on this. Ajak, what more can you tell us about security, that security operation in Nigeria's central northern state of Niger? Well, uh, Penina, this, uh, the killing of uh, about 200 armed gunmen in Niger State is part of uh, a security operation that has been going on in the state for the past uh, uh, year or so. Uh, now, the President Muhammad Buhari directed the uh, military to deploy personnel to the state after uh, dozens of school children were kidnapped from an Islamic school in Niger State uh, last year. And so there's been joint operation between the police, uh, the military, and of course local uh, security outfits called the vigilante groups in the region. Uh, they've been working to root out armed gunmen who have been kidnapping people for ransom. Uh, and security officials who have been working in those operations said uh, they've been able to neutralize bandits in the state. They've been also able to uh, recover weapons uh, as well as uh, rescue uh, victims uh, who have been abducted by those uh, gunmen. So there has been a joint operation going on, and this latest development is uh, part of the military operation going on in the state to root out armed bandits in the state.